In this video, I'll walk you through the process of installing Reshade in 5M for the best gaming experience. First, I'll demonstrate on how to install and unblock Reshade in 5M. Then, I'll provide you with three fantastic presets that will work with NV, QuantV, and other graphic modifications to enhance your gaming experience. And finally, I'll guide you through customizing and fine-tuning the appearance as well as saving and editing our presets. So let's dive into the world of graphic modifications and take your gaming experience to a whole new level. So without further ado, let's get started. I will leave a link in the description that will lead you towards my Discord server. Go ahead and join Discord. After you verify yourself, you can go ahead, scroll down to links and resources, go to the post called 5M Graphics, and we're gonna go to post number four. Here we'll have some links that we will be visiting today uh, besides that we also have an installation service for anyone that's lazy you can pick a package and we will install it remotely going back to links and resources let's go ahead and visit link number one that's gonna be this right here you can click download and download right here it will download reshade for us uh, part number two we're gonna come back to that that's the unblock 5m uh, and then we have the presets that I mentioned before these pre presets will each work with either quant V NV or with or without any graphic modifications installed so you have plenty of options right here let's go ahead and download them it's not necessary for you to download them if you already have something that's totally fine um, it is currently blocked as you can see I don't know why I just uploaded them to discord myself of course download this on your own risk these are my own files by the way uh download and download so i just saved them in reshade uh in 5m and exported them to discord okay let's go ahead and grab our downloaded files and our 5m application data folder so we have the files we just downloaded. I'm gonna show you how to open up your 5M application data folder. Go ahead and search for 5M, right click on it and click on open file location. It will pop up a folder where you can again, right click on it and click on open file location. Here, you'll double click on 5M application data. It will open up this folder and this is where we will be installing some files. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to open up the reshade setup file double click on it after you open it make sure you cho choose your right uh, grand theft auto game data folder if you don't know where that is i'm going to quickly show you you can just open up steam if you're using steam go to library right click on grand theft auto click on manage and browse local files it will open up the location as you see it this will be your location and this is the location you can find right here you can either just copy it copy go here and paste it hit enter and then you're going to click on this file right here as you can see um, and then we're going to click on next make sure to click on direct x 11 uh, uh, 10 11 or 12 hit next here you can just skip everything, hit next again, uncheck and check all, and hit next. Now it's gonna download and the files and install Reshade in GTA. So not in 5M yet. We're gonna get to that part in a bit, hold on. So that's finished. And the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna actually open up our Grand Theft Auto main directory folder. Again, that was very easy to do that, just as how I do it. There we go. And we're gonna go ahead and copy a few files here to our 5M application data folder. We're gonna right click here and we're gonna go ahead and create a new folder. We're gonna call it the plugins folder and we're gonna open it up. Here, we're gonna go ahead and select a few files that I select. That's gonna be this one right here. Scroll down, you're gonna select this one. Correction, not this one right here. Go down until you see this right here and this and this. Don't worry, I'm going to zoom in in a bit and you will see what I mean and how many files these are exactly. So it's going to be five files and let me zoom in for y'all. It's going to be these five files and a folder. So we're ready for the next step and that's to start up 5M. We're not there yet. 
but I am going to quickly show you some things we need to change. But before we do all that, let's go ahead and copy our presets right here. So we have them ready. You can actually just make a folder also in here that uh, maybe will be easier to keep all your presets. And name it reshape preset and just drag those three files and any other files that you may have right there. I don't know where I moved it. Let me go ahead and fix that and drag it right here. There we go. Now let's start up 5M quickly. 5M is started up. The first thing that you want to do is you want to go to settings and uncheck this right here. Okay, you have to uncheck it or reshade will not work. Uncheck it. Not like this, but like this. You can close that. Then we will hit F8. And as you can see, it is currently blocked. This is what I mentioned in the beginning of the video. I'm going to show you how to unblock this. So what will you need? First of all, you need your ID code. Mine will be right here. With you, it will say something else. All you need to do is just to type in your id code like i am typing in mine right here after you copied it we're gonna go ahead and close up the game uh currently it is not working so it is blocked again we're gonna close it up and then we're gonna go a folder back we're gonna go to this citizen fx.ini file and we're gonna open it up it opens up this folder this file right here now let's hop over back to discord and here is where line number two comes uh, in place let me just paste that number so i don't forget we're gonna change this into this let's just copy the whole line as i do uh, let me zoom in for you guys so you're gonna copy this right here copy that copy text go back and i'm just gonna put it we're gonna select this code the id code and we're gonna just change it right here exactly like how i do okay i'm gonna show it even better in the text document maybe this is not totally clear let's get back here what you're gonna do is you'll have to place an enter right here like i do and just paste it this is how you want it to be exactly this even though it didn't look so good in the discord this is how it should be okay you just copy it place your id and that's it you can go ahead and close it and launch 5m again and now we will work it's that easy where's 5m let's go ahead and see if it's working i'm excited and let's get this uh, video finished up quickly and there you go it's loading up so in game you can press the home button it will open up reshade you can click on skip tutorial and go ahead uh, click on settings the first thing that i'm going to show you is how to change the home button because that will conflict with other things in 5m servers most of them at least the ones that i play in and i will change it to end and you can hit escape to save and now it will be the end key press the key that you set it and go to home here you can go ahead and go to the folder that you created called reset reshade preset and click one of the presets that i provided as you can see it will change instantly again uh this one for instance is for nve but you can use it like this too because you see the changes are pretty nice and here you go for quant v and here is for with or without any graphic modifications uh, it is currently nighttime, so here this you will see the most difference with this one because this one will work oh damn what the hell is that uh this one will work with any with or without a graphic modifications uh besides that let me quickly show you how to change edit and uh save a preset so if we want to remove something here it's easily done as you can see blooming but what we also can do is we can edit the categories let's go here if we want to add this or increase or decrease it it's very easily to do so and you can save it it will save it instantly you can also create a new one uh create a new name that's how easy you do that and lastly if you want to switch over to other presets you just double click on it right here and that being said we are coming to an end of this video i hope you enjoyed it i hope you saw the value in it please if so do let me know in the comment section 
Thank you all for watching and have a great evening and enjoy your gaming experience. Goodbye.